I shall not falter. Fine. I shall clean up your mess. What do you want? Why are you in Lower Kyalasa, Temurian? Your kind usually avoids the city. We refuse to work while our enemies even now are closing in on our most precious relic. You're a mine worker. A slave master for one of the noble houses. We work for House of the Eagle, but the Matriarch will not let us recover our heritage. No iron until we have what is rightfully ours. What is it? We should leave the talking to Tsar. They'll be more cooperative with someone of their kind. What do you want? I shall not fail. Take me up now. Now is as good a time as any to talk. The winchman cannot hear us. You have discovered something? Yes? Something Kren sent you to uncover? Indeed we have. Do not tell me what it is. If we are captured and tortured, my ignorance could save us. Do you know where Krenz is? I don't know. And if we're lucky, neither do the Pentanera. Right now, Lady Mara and the rest of the Pentanera are expecting me for our next ritual. If I don't turn up, they'll be suspicious. We shall have to be at the Civil Mage's villa when it happens. And if we're fortunate, we can learn something helpful at the same time. Rebuilt above its own rubble, yet again. I do not recognize this architecture. The latest fashion. I have no idea where it comes from. The city has been sacked so often, and each time it takes on a new face. I shall not fail. Damn, that's Evanger at the bar. I thought we were here to spy upon the Pentanera. This is too dangerous. We should leave. No, trust your magic, Carissa. We must see if your enchantment conceals us. If it does not, better one of the Pentanera to flee from than all of them. Baron Avanger? Well, I'm in here. Call me Tar. I've never called you by your first name, Baron. You've never come drinking with me before. Now share a drink with me or leave. I've no interest in talking about the Order while I'm under this roof. Very well. I'll share a drink with you. There's hope for you yet, Carissa. I think my eyelids are stuck to my eyeballs. Malas, 
crushed my head with thy witch's brew. Ah, oh. oh my head. I swear I will never touch another drop of mead. This foe is mine. Thou shalt face me now! I demand an audience with Lady Cyrene Akhtar. Pathetic! I shall handle this myself. Lady Carissa, what a pleasure to see you again. I am no lady, Cyrene. House Cantrek fell centuries ago. How remiss of me to forget. Does the Inquisition have something to discuss with my house? Ask your questions, child. Any word on the heir to House Malfagon? How fortuitous you should ask this. Am I to take it that the Inquisition's interests are not served by Prolocutor Tiberius? Prolocutor Tiberius is a risk. We prefer to avoid such things. Although it pains me to admit it, young Kiri Malfagon is vital to maintaining order in Kyalisa. I have learned that the Prolocutor is responsible for her disappearance. Since we are united against him, we should work together, yes? I know where young Lady Kiri is being held, and it is my fancy that you rescue her. Save me your excuses. You will do this in return for the one thing I have that the Inquisition desires. The soul of Darius, the Lion of Corwinth. I see I have your attention, Carissa. It is my understanding that the Inquisition is in the market for the souls of great warriors. And who could be greater than the Lion of Corwinth? Ask your questions, child. I shall rescue Kerry Malfagon for you in return for Darius's soul. Excellent. I thought I might be able to entice you. Travel forthwith to Broken Spear Pass on the border of Temuria. Kiri is held by Sebekan slavers there. Rescue her and bring her back to Kyalisa. You shall receive your reward. What is it, hmm? I hear you're having problems with your mining operations. My husband acquired a great many of the mines in Sundered Shield, and House of the Eagle still administrates these assets. But, yes, there is a problem with the slave masters who work the undead miners. They are refusing to work until some staff is returned to them. I should never have hired those Temurians. Human workers are much more reliably motivated by silver. What do you want? What can you tell me about this staff? It is the last remaining artifact of the Grey Claw Shamans, who were all exterminated when that tribe fled to Corwenth. The staff is said to be imparted with the sum of their last shaman's arcane knowledge, for all that is worth. A rumor recently surfaced that the Blood Pact knows where the last Greyclaw shaman's staff was concealed. Now those bone idle mutts refuse to run the mine unless their artifact is returned to them. This is what I get for extending a hand of friendship to foreigners. What do you want? 
I will seek the last Grey Claw Shaman staff for you, as a show of goodwill. Indeed. Well, my goodwill is seldom easily acquired, as you know. You could do worse than to ask House Macula about the staff. There is little in the ways of magic that they do not take an interest in. Archon Meddler can often be found in that disreputable tavern, if you can stomach the place. I find these audiences tiring. I shall take my leave now, Lady Cyrene. There's no one here yet. That gives us some time. We should talk to the power brokers, see what we can learn. Prolocutor Tiberius, Lady Cyrene of the House of Eagle, perhaps Madame Zoftik if she's in town.
Carissa, do come in. Perlocutor Tiberius, I have some questions for you. Of course. You know I'm more than happy to assist the Inquisition. How can I help? What news of the heir to House Malfagon? Alas, the heir to the Lord Protectorship of Corwenth is still missing. I suspect kidnapping, but I've received no demands. I continue to act as Regent Protector in her stead, but how long this can remain a secret is anyone's guess. The seal of the Lord Protector is still warm, so the line of House Malfagon is not yet ended. But Kiri is the last of the Malfagons. If she dies, it could mean war between the noble houses of Kyalasar. How can I help? What do you intend to do if Kiri is not found? It's a difficult situation, as I'm sure you appreciate. If House Malfagon falls, it could mean civil war for Cormanth, since each noble house will claim the protectorship for themselves. There is one possibility worth pursuing. The Seal of the Warlord. You would resurrect the title of Warlord? Legally speaking, the Lord Protector is only sovereign in the Warlord's stead. The betrayal and execution of the Warlord of Kyalasar three centuries ago ended his family as a political force. Yet if the Seal of the Warlord were recovered, well, wouldn't that present an interesting situation? How can I help? What could you offer me for the Seal of the Warlord? If you are able to recover the seal, I could offer you something very special indeed. The soul of Fallon, the Huntress of the Wastes. The Inquisition may have ended a life, but perhaps you have need of the soul of a great warrior now. Hmm? I have located the seal of the Warlord here in Kyalasar, but it is beyond my power to recover it. I need someone with your talents. What do you want to know? What are your thoughts on Sarin Akhtar and the House of the Eagle? Why do you ask? Mere curiosity. I want to know if you view her as an ally or a threat. Her marriage means she is no longer strictly a Malfagan, but she is still Kiri's aunt. She is surely a close ally of House Malfagan. You need my assistance? Who has a motive to block Fallen Eagle Pass? I'm uncertain, but these are desperate times. The Noble Houses scheme while House Malfagan seems vulnerable. Cutting off the battalion at Fallen Eagle Pass weakens our position considerably. You need my assistance? How long have there been wild griffins in Fallen Eagle Pass? I'm uncertain. It has to be recent, though. They usually avoid the inhabited places. What can I do for you? Did you know there are storm furies in Fallen Eagle Pass? Belligerent elementals this close to Kyalisar? These are dark times indeed. How can I help? There was a Grey Claw Shaman outside Fallen Eagle Fortress. That could explain the problems in the pass. A Tamurian Shaman could summon elementals and call down the griffins. Whoever is moving against House Malfagon has both wealth and influence. Just as you do, Prolocutor. Indeed. I wonder which of the noble houses it might be. How can I help? I shall take my leave now, Prolocutor. Pathetic! I shall handle this myself.
A furless cub will arrive soon. She is under my protection. If any harm befalls her, you will answer to me. Aye, sir. You will be returned to Kyalazar as soon as it can be arranged. I should think so, too. Shalt face me now. This enemy is mine. I shall show thee true power. Shall not fail. Excellent. Well done, Carissa. I knew you could do it. Young Kiri is safely ensconced at Fallen Eagle Fortress, where she fully expects you to visit her. I have given her the soul of the Lion of Corwenth to give to you. Do not tell me what you intend to do with it. It is better I do not know. Now, please leave. This foe is mine.
shalt face me now! I shall show thee true power! Fallen Eagle Fortress. I demand an audience with Kiri Malfagon. She knows who I am. Finally come to claim your reward. Ah, I've been expecting you, my gallant rescuer. Welcome to Fallen Eagle Fortress, demon. How dare you call me a demon, child? Oh, 
drop the charade, Evia. We both know you died centuries ago. Don't worry. Your secret is safe with me, Daughter of Fire. I have prepared quarters for you. The reward I promised is waiting for you there. After you've settled in, I would speak with you, demon. Until then... Tremble before a princess of the Gerulian throne! knows too much. Thou shalt need to slay her. That is not your decision, demon. Thou art my puppet, mortal! I am no one's puppet, demon. Least of all yours. We are in grave danger if our secret gets out. It will be Tamoria all over again. Let me handle this. Kiri is a dangerous ally, but she's practical. She needs us, or she would not have put on such a show about welcoming us. And thy legends call demons treacherous.
You need my assistance? I've come to relieve you of the burden of Prolocutor. Ah. I see. Well, uh, I'm no match for you in battle. Of course. What has Kiri offered you to end my life? The soul of the Lion of Corwenth. I have a counteroffer. The soul of the Huntress of the Wastes. You have the soul of Fallon? Indeed I do. The Inquisition may have found it necessary to slay her, but you could use her now, I think. Darius is as strong a warrior as Fallon. Perhaps, but his sense of honor may make him difficult to deploy effectively. You'll offer me Fallon for your life? I need more than that. Even if you don't kill me today, Kiri will send someone else. I have no intention of attacking the heir to House Malfagon. Of course, of course. <laughs> Nothing could be further from my mind. You know what I want. The seal of the Warlord. Bring it to me, and Fallon is yours. I shall not bargain with you, Prolocutor. Let's get on with this. Guards! Guards!
open up in the name of the Inquisition! I shall not fail. Do you feel that? Powerful forces are nearby. It is time. The Pentanera have returned. I should not be here. If my family see me... We will be discreet, I promise you. No one need know about your... situation. Why have you brought me back from death? The less you know, the better. Suffice it to say that Corwent is in peril, and we work to prevent its destruction. This is not easy for me. I had said my goodbyes. I was ready to die. But for my family's sake, if nothing else, I will fight on.
I trust you are well, Tar. We're not in the thirst for revenge now, Carissa. You must observe the formalities. Oh, I apologize, Baron. But you impressed me the other night. I did not think you had it in you. Have you found Karenz? I have not. Although we will surely discuss this at tedious length shortly. It is time. Let the Pentanera renew their vows and bear witness. This convocation of the Pentanera of the Order of the Veil is convened. Since we still lack a high sage, I will act as proxy for this role again. I shall summon the Crucible of Souls from its place in shadow. I am the Eye. I shall seek the path. I am the fire. I shall purge idolatry. I am the blade. I shall rend our foes asunder. I speak for the quill. I shall bear witness. I am the heart. I shall welcome our allies. The veil continues to weaken. I do not know how much longer we can continue to channel essence from here. The situation is even worse in Thull. We will have to attend to this problem before too long. And now, let us proceed with the formal business. I will take reports on behalf of the High Sage. Lord Valkyrin failed to apprehend Krenz after we intercepted him and his vassal at the foot of Jagged Peaks. An Avenger was outwitted by the demon that Krenz has summoned. The demon is unimportant. Only Krenz matters. I disagree. This demon is not like those we now inhabit. Indeed. How so? When our souls were bound to these demons, we became their pacts. We have their instincts, but they have our memories and our restrictions. Baron of Danger's demon, for instance, is blind in shadow because he is a sightless maid. I am still more than capable of fulfilling my role. This new demon, I do not know what Krenz has done, but it seems to have the ability to embody many souls. And gain the powers of each. Such is my understanding. Krenz's vassal is not important. I vouch to slay it personally. Under the circumstances, a capture may be more prudent. Carissa, how have you fared? I'm sorry, Lady Mara. I have failed to locate Krenz. Do not trouble yourself, child. Your elders have proved equally ineffectual. While Krenz is at large, he remains a serious threat to the Order. He could be our undoing. I will end that traitor's life personally. You would have to be capable of catching him first. I will not bear such calumny from you, Valkyrin. Order! Order! Forgive me, High Magus. I meant no disrespect. What plans are afoot for apprehending Krenz? I shall continue to study his library in the hope that I might find something useful. While I conduct the painstaking work of searching alone. Both avenues of inquiry are worth pursuing. What other risks do we face? I have taken steps to eliminate our last remaining threat, the so-called market of knowledge. The Ishkai rebels of the Confederacy have acquired a substantial collection of scrolls, tomes, and transcripts from both the oracle and the oral traditions. Indeed. And the collection at Ishana Kurai may rival even Krenza's library for its encyclopedic erudition. There is a chance, however small, 
that they know something that could threaten us. Fortunately, the Ishkai will soon cease to be a concern. Is it arranged, Evanger? It is, Hymagus. The Razor Feather Sora have accepted our payment and are already mobilizing for war. You plan to send Sura mercenaries to sack Ishanakurai? I intend to annihilate the Ishkai Confederacy entirely. A task the Ishkai's former masters are pleased to perform for us. Do we have any other business? The werewolf anarchist coup has failed. Why should we care about Taimorian power struggles? Do not waste our time, Carissa. Do we have any other business? What will happen to the House of the Lion? Really, Carissa? Why should any of us care about this? Ashma Sinkasarat! You are not Carissa. Or at least you are not solely Carissa. Serge, we will have need of your talents with this intruder. How many souls does it possess? Hard to say. Perhaps half a dozen? How has Krenz achieved this? That is what I hope to establish. Mother. It's awake. Do you wish to question the demon first? It is irrelevant to me. Who else is there? Your old ally, Princess Evia. A Timurian berserker and some other creatures. And Carissa, of course. Manifest Evia. I will speak to her first. Lady Mara, what is the meaning of this? It is you, after all these years. And still so young. Release me this instant! I'm afraid that cannot be. Your soul belongs to this demon. Mara, I was once your friend and your ally. Release me so we can talk. The Reliquary Crusade was centuries ago, Evia. I scarcely remember who I was then. Tell me, how did you come to possess Carissa's soul? I have no idea. She's lying. Sink in your claws, Serge. Discourage any further obfuscation. That was before you sided with my enemies, Evia. What have you learned, hmm? Where did Krenz send you? Krenz sent me into Temuria on some damn fool quest that turned out to be a wild goose chase. Another lie. Sink your claws in deeper, Surge. Motivate her towards the truth. I am beyond damnation, child. I will tell you nothing! She speaks the truth. Your mother trained you too well, Avia. A shame. I would have enjoyed reminiscing with you. Manifest Carissa. Perhaps she will prove more helpful. You might as well finish me now. I will not help you. My son is quite an expert at extracting information. Indeed. He taught me how to torture others. And how to resist being tortured. 
My skills have only sharpened since I was your master, Carissa. You were never my master, Valkyrin. You've not lost your touch, Valkyrin. Sink your claws deeper, Serge. Break her spirit. Do not make this more unpleasant than it need be, Carissa. Ah! <laughs> you left a bit, Valkyrin. Ah! That tickles! These jokes are not like you, Carissa. Tell us what Krenz sent you to discover, Carissa. And this will end. Still under your mother's thumb, eh, Valkyrin? We all have our prisons. Serge! You disappoint me yet again. Do not blame your son for your failure. Failure, Carissa? I have succeeded far more than the Order ever thought possible. This immortality is my victory. And you can still share that with us. I will never help you again! This is pointless, Mother. She will tell us nothing. Watch your tongue, Serge. Remember who you are speaking to. Is there anyone else in there who might crack more easily? Enough. Whatever Krenz has done to this demon, it is not like the rest. No, indeed. This one is a whore, sharing its body with every soul it tastes. I shall bring thy death for this insult. Manifest someone else. Perhaps if I could study Krenz's library, Mother, I might have more success. You disappoint me, Serge. You are never adequately prepared. Very well. Tear the souls from this abomination, incapacitate it, and seal the cell. As you wish, Mother. <laughs>